<laughs> Alright, man, we here again. This is DJ TV. This is Jay Kareem. I'm here with my boy. DM Cool. Cool's doing the scene. Man, we're gonna do a movie review for you guys. I haven't done one in a while. We're gonna do this on Wolfman, man. Oh! Woo! Oh. I, I, I'm sorry, I had to re-explain that bitch. Wolfman, alright? Wolfman. Did you see Wolfman? I see Wolfman. Did you see Wolfman? No. Nah. Alright, I'm gonna take a look. Wolfman, okay? Now, <laughs> this movie. I'm just sitting back relaxing. I <laughs> tried, okay? I tried! Okay, it starts off, you know, it's classic Victorian, you know, England. You know how it goes, you know, 1856, everyone's still riding fucking carriages and shit. You got freaking, they have one seat guy in there who's a butler. I'm glad it's, you know, black slavery. <laughs> it was like Sikh slavery. I was like, that's not too bad, you know? So it starts off, you know, there's this guy and like he owns his mansion and like his son gets Question. killed by a werewolf. And then his other son who lives in America who was sent there when he was young because he witnessed his mother die by the hands of his father, but he didn't know his father killed the mother. It's like a big story, you know? So he comes back from America, tries to solve his brother's death, you know? One thing leads to another, meets a bunch of gypsies, the werewolf attacks him in the forest, he gets bit. Now, the werewolf, you know, cut a story short, the werewolf who killed his brother was his dad, because his father was the original werewolf, and his father was a werewolf that bit him too. So now he's a werewolf. So now he's dealing with the problem, you know, psychiatrists in England have him captive, and they're trying to, like, figure out what's wrong with him, because nobody believes him. They have some, like, fucking, um secret investigator who comes in town who reminds me of the fucking what's that guy's name? Um, not even Sherlock fucking Holmes. What's his name? Fucking um Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Nah, not even that man. I can't remember okay fucking Professor Xavier. No man. Fucking Dr. Zayas. No fuck <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Zayas, Dr. Zayas, Dr. Zayas, Dr. Zayas, Dr. Zayas. <laughs> nah man, fucking um What's that movie called? The Outlaws, the Out fucking St. Valentine's Day Mask, whatever the fuck, okay, whatever, whatever, whatever. I'll move it after. Okay. So, whatever, you know, the Outlaw, this guy comes in from out of town, has to solve the thing. This guy has no part in the movie. He has like four lines, he does nothing, he doesn't even solve shit, okay? It's a waste of the whole fucking movie, okay? Now, the movie, you know what? I don't, I'll leave it there. If you want to see it, I'll leave it there. You can watch the rest, okay? I ruined enough. But the movie was decent, okay? The storyline was good. It was decent. Until the part where I seen the wolf. I saw the wolf. This is the first movie since fucking... What was that bullshit that <laughs> about the fucking... Um, what was that fucking bullshit, yo? That bullshit. I don't know. There's a lot of bullshit in this world, Justin. You need to be more specific. <laughs> yo, the bullshit about the... And he's like, oh... Take it ass. <laughs> Where the guy's jerking a Pamela Addison and Borat. This was worse than Borat, okay? I wanted to walk out the theater, okay? When I, it's not even the same. I was, okay, okay, okay. I was holding my piss for an hour, okay? Then I see the wolf. I'm like, fuck, I'm going to the washroom. I held my piss three hours through Avatar. You just. I went to the washroom. I took my time to piss. I washed my hands. I looked around. And, and it took a drink. It was a struggle to wash your hands, I washed it. It really was. <laughs> do what you gotta do, nigga. Then I came back, okay? Now, let me say, okay, the wolf, I don't know if it was the makeup, but suppose the movie was made two years ago and they brought it back for a year to add effects to the wolf. They ain't mad shit. The wolf looked like Michael J. Fox and Teen Wolf, okay? Oh, With the shit. fucking basketball passing it around. It was like Big Wolf on campus. And there's one part where you see one wolf fighting with the next wolf. It's like an old gray ass wolf with a new black ass wolf. And it was like two little teddy bears cuddling. Like the wolf has a big smile on his face. Like he's making Joker. Why oh, so serious? What the fuck was I watching? I was like, this is bullshit. This is straight utter bullshit. You know what, man? I don't know what the ratings are. What is it? Top dollar? Blockbuster that bitch, are you fucking kidding me? Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. I want my money back. Fuck you. I don't know who produced it. I don't know who wrote it. I don't know who directed it. I don't care. I know it was on the Universal or Fox or some shit. Fuck you. Wow. You wasted my 10 bucks. Fuck you. <laughs> and on that note, we'll end the movie. <laughs> On that note, we'll end the movie review there. So, Fuck! Oh, yeah. Okay, okay, Justin, okay, okay. Jim Cool, Jake Reed, very angry as you can see. Drew Reed's behind the camera, and we out, alright? Fuck you! Easy. No.